Hi, my name is Russell. I'm a librarian at the University of Alabama. This video will show you the features of Mango Premiere, a collection of streaming films available on the Mango platform. Specifically, you will learn how Premiere's color-coded subtitles, pronunciation assistance, and cultural notes can help you achieve your language learning goals. Let's begin by opening Mango. On the library's homepage, select the databases link from the quick menu. Locate Mango Languages under M on the A to Z list. When you click on Mango Languages, a login screen appears where you can either enter as a guest or you can log into your personal account. Not all languages will have content from Mango Premiere, so keep that in mind when you are developing your language learning goals. Let's say we wanted a more advanced understanding of French. Select the language icon and click on the Explore tab. Then click anywhere on the Mango Premiere logo to proceed. Every film in Premiere will have a small space that details certain information, including the title and the age rating. You can even click on the More Info button to view the movie's summary, directory, and cast. Two films have been designated under French. Because we want a more advanced understanding of French, let's pick the more adult-oriented La Moustache. In order to run Mango Premiere, you need to install Adobe Flash Player and enable it in your browser. A link to Adobe's Flash Player help page is available in the description below this video. There are two different ways to view films in Premiere, Movie Mode and Engage Mode. Movie Mode allows you to watch the film uninterrupted without any mandated breaks, while Engage Mode breaks down scenes into grammar and vocabulary lessons. Whichever option you pick, you always have the ability to select what kind of subtitles you want to appear alongside the film. For La Moustache, we can either have only English subtitles, only French subtitles, both, or no subtitles at all. Another great option is the ability to color code the subtitles so that you can visualize how certain parts of one sentence in a language relate to a different part of a sentence in another language. Here's an example. The top sentence is the French subtitles, and the bottom sentence is the translated English subtitles. Each color-coded word on the top corresponds to a color-coded word on the bottom. These color-coded words help you see the similarities and differences in the vocabulary and syntax between two languages. To get an even more detailed examination of the language, we can use Engage Mode to break down each scene in each line of dialogue. Engage Mode introduces each scene with a summary in the target language and in English. It also provides a list of vocabulary terms that are in the scene, and it includes cultural notes so that viewers understand the context of the scene. Once you have viewed the scene, you can head to the follow-up step, where Mango Premiere will separate each line of dialogue so you can learn part by part. In this line, for instance, you can replay the clip to hear the dialogue. You can look at the color-coded dialogue to remember the vocabulary and the grammar. But you can also view the phonetic pronunciation of the dialogue, which is meant to represent the sounds of the target language so this tool can assist you in speaking a language in a standard, understandable way. Lastly, you can navigate through Engage Mode by toggling through each step in each scene, or you can select the chapter menu and find a particular scene you want to review. And you always have the option to switch back and forth between Engage Mode and Movie Mode. That's all for now, thanks for watching! If you have further questions on using Mango Premiere, you can email me at rtpeterson1 at ua.edu or visit ask.lib.ua.edu to ask a librarian.